Hi everyone, Masala here. So I'm always experimenting with regrowing veggie scraps. So this time I'm trying out lemongrass. I had a friend that gave me these stalks about three and a half weeks ago and I placed them in water. So far so good, they are rooting. Check out these roots on this one here. It's about, I think, at least three inches long. So this is definitely ready to go in a pot of soil. I think that when the roots are about one to two inches long, they should be ready to go in pots. So I initially took off all the dead foliage or the tan, you know, um, dead looking foliage or leaves that's around the stalks. And I also cut off part of the stalk. I cut it down about four inches. And you can see where I cut it right here. And these are all the new growth, the new leaf blades. And I place them in a jar with two inches of water, which I change daily to prevent any bacteri bacterial growth so it doesn't rot. So if you'd like to give this a try, change the water at least every one to two days. After I placed them in water, I kept the jars near a window out of direct sunlight, so indirect light. That way the roots are not exposed to the light. So we're going to go ahead and get this in pots. We're we'll head outside and I'll be keeping them outdoors during the summertime, but we'll be bringing them indoors or overwintering them during the winter months and also springtime because it's still cold out here in the Pacific Northwest. So, and we'll keep track of the progress and we'll keep you posted. So we'll go ahead and get this planted today. I am using a store-bought organic potting mix made from compost coconut coir and yucca, so this will provide good moisture retention as well as dra water drainage. We're going to be adding a couple of tablespoons of Vermistera's worm castings. Going to work that into the soil, just like so. Worm castings will not only feed your plants, but it will provide our soil with beneficial microbes, bacteria, and fungi, which will also improve the soil's health as well as our plants. So I'm just going to just dig a shallow hole there. I'm going to bury it about an inch and a half of the stalk. it down firmly around the stalk. Let's take this one has the really long roots so I'm just spacing them about four inches apart in this pot and I can transplant them later into a bigger container. All right everyone got our lemon grasses planted. I'll be placing these in the shade for the next three days to slowly acclimate them to the outdoor conditions. So this goes the same with any plants that you transplant or seedlings. That way they don't go to shock and some as they can die if you put them in direct sunlight. And make sure you keep them watered so that way they get enough moisture especially when it's hot. Thanks for joining me guys. Stay tuned for the update. I am so excited to harvest some fresh stalks in the near future. Thanks for joining me guys and happy gardening.